What's up, everybody? I'm your host, Brian Watkins, and welcome to another edition of the Brian Watkins Channel. My subject today is about how to get any woman you want guaranteed. The reason why I'm making this video is for, oh, I can't see a thing, I gotta clean my glasses, is for um, all the fellas that learn how to master this or ones that will agree with what I'm about to say. Either way, let's get started. Now, in order for this to work, there are a few requirements. Okay, number one, this is for the women that are extremely attractive. No disrespect to those who are standardly attractive. It's, it's a lot of, you know, interesting points in that, but this is not for them. This is for the extremely attractive ones, like rating from a one to ten, they're like a, a, a hundred or a thousand. It's for them. And, and it works, fellas. That's the thing. That's all you got to do. Excuse the noise in the background. This is what you do. Okay, reason why I'm targeting them because she has to have a certain amount of ego in order for this to work. Okay. Um, this is all you have to do. Let's use Starbucks for an example. Starbucks here in Michigan, in Royal Oak, Michigan, off of Main Street. I've been to a lot of Starbucks. They have the finest women. Like women that look like Beyonce, um, Alicia Keys, Rihanna. A lot of them look better than them. They come in there all the time. <coughs> all shapes and sizes, tall ones, short ones, mid height. Uh, some of them real thick, slim, big chest, big butt, all of the above. They all come in there. This is how you make it work. See, say you see one that you, you know, you want to pull. Okay. Now, before I go into it, I, I actually used this by mistake and it worked. I was trying to tell um, those kind of women they're extremely attractive. Okay. I was trying to warn them of something. You know, like this happened about ten minutes ago. I was trying to tell her to don't go in the ladies restroom because there was a plumber in there. But again, this one, I'm 6'2", she was about 6'3", fine too, and was dressed really, really nice. Anyway, so I went to tell her, no, and she gonna look and turn her nose up and roll her eye. Oh, well, go, hey, go on and walk on in there. And she walked, she came back out and she looked over to me to see what I gonna be looking at, like, hey, well, you know, I was trying to warn you, you know, and by the way, let me get your phone number, can we talk? Mm. Fellas, do the complete opposite. I look the opposite way. Or, again, she got to have a, a big ego for this to work. Because women that look that pretty, it, they get easily pissed off, ego easily bruised, when, when someone ignored them, because they're not used to that, see? And that's what I did. I totally looked the opposite way, like, yeah, I was just trying to warn you about the bathroom. I wasn't trying to talk to you. And see, that bothers those kind of women. This is like the second time I didn't put an extremely attractive woman without trying, but they got upset because I wasn't trying to, you know, talk to them. Even though they was going to tell me no. But, it's, but again, see, it's her ego at that point. And this is how you can use her bruised ego to your advantage. Because all she's going to do now, like, she had got the coffee to go, but because of the fact I was just trying to actually warn her that someone that was in the bathroom working, fixing something that was wrong in the ladies' restroom, see, her, her, now she feels stupid, okay, cheated, and rejected. Now, this is all in her mind now. I was just, you know, she was walking that way, and I'm just like, hey, don't go. And she looked. Rolled her eyes and went, okay, fine, go on and walk on in there. So again, then she was thinking that I may wonder that she is also kind of dumb, you know. So that's how I played it. Now she, she's sitting in Starbucks right now. She done took her laptop out. So on purpose, I took, you know, my little trash and stuff and threw it in the trash can, which happened to be next to her because I was heading out of the building to make this video. 
and she glared up at me like, bastard, how dare you not try to talk to me even though I was going to tell you no. Now, I've been through this before at the same location now. A year ago, same situation, was trying to warn of an extremely attractive pretty woman about something. And uh, she did the same thing. And when she learned that I was not trying to talk to her fellas, she stalked me at that Starbucks for about a good five months. I had to stop coming up there. It got that bad. Now, this one's the same thing. See, it's easy to pull them kind of women because they take it because they have huge egos. A helium balloon or a blimp balloon don't got nothing on the size of their ego. And it works. It works just as long as it's something. So they got what they got to They have to. Um, they have to detect, were you sincere? Which I was, both times. I was. I just was like, hey, it turned their nose and like, <laughs> all right, well, fuck it then. You're walking there and find out that it's a guy in there that got all his tools everywhere fixing the ladies' restroom. I said, watch. When she come out of the bathroom, she's going to glare over to me to see if I'm like, <laughs> yeah, see, I was just trying to look out for you, baby. Now, if you want to repay me for being generous, Gonna let me, uh, you know, get that phone number or buy you a cup of coffee. I didn't do none of that shit. I looked over at the other side of the one that was like, oh, well, you want to be stupid, have your head up in your ass this early in the damn morning. Keep it up there. She went, got the coffee, sat down, popped open her laptop and looked like, oh, so you want to be Mr. Super Asshole. I'm like, no, I was just trying to warn you. I wasn't trying to talk to you. I've met a lot of extremely attractive women like that. Or just behave like you're uh, you're you're more attractive looking than them, man. They, they, but again, if they got a big ego, they gotta have a big, 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 big ego. I mean, a huge one, in order for it to work. They do all the work for you, you know. And really, you don't have to really do nothing spectacular. Just don't pay no attention to her, you know. And, and pick up, or if she asks you something, you know. Yes. Uh, no. In, in terms. Of, oh, wait. Am I, am, I, am, I, am I bothering you? You know, you can switch it around. So you want me to lie? You want me to tell you the truth? Push you. Make a damn choice. Hey, you know, do like this. Don't touch me. And man, they cannot have, for you know it, now, you, now that's the thing, fellas. Now once you didn't achieve all that, you got to come back up there the next two or three days in a row because this is what she's going to tell herself. Mm -hmm. I'm going to make sure I'm going to stop by there and check out Mr. Asshole before I go to work. Little motherfucker had got some nerve to be for. He know how fucking fine I am? Shit. You know what I mean? With guys wish... Wish they would see my pussy. Man, he gonna act all like this. I'm gonna teach his little ass a lesson. And that's when they take your the whole bait, hook, line, and sinker. It works. So subscribe to my channel for two reasons. I make videos constantly and you can win some money. Um, if you like this video, click that you do. If you don't, click that you don't. Continue to leave your comments, leave your video requests. I'll respond to them. Uh, Accordingly, as soon as possible, and um, continue to uh, support the Brian Walker's channel by making a donation to my link in the description box. Don't you go anywhere.